Hello to my Brunei and friends and Malaysian friends, Indonesian friends, Filipino friends, and American friends. Every friends I get. Hello everybody. Welcome to my channel. This is right now. So. tips or things you need to know about this channel so oh no fuck what channel I'm stopping <laughs> for really action I'm giving you tips and things you need to know about Brunei so let's talk about Brunei for a while it's been a while since I upload my videos. What the crap? I'm going to upload my number seven vlogs. Then I'm going to upload this also. So it's just a minute time. Tangina, no pinang sa sa biko. So we are we again uh, speaking English again and uh, oh shit. Tangina, ang hirap maging bisblad. Ay, na ginusto ko to eh. Panindigan ko to. Ano lang, ganun. Makapalan na lang ng mukha to. Ito. One eternity later. So, ayun nga na. No. Kumusta kayo guys? Kumusta kayo lahat? Salamat sa pag-subscribe niyo sa channel ko. Maraming salamat. Uh, ay, putang yun ha. Limutan ko. English na pala ako dito ngayon. Puta. So, what's up sa inyo mga subscriber? To my subscribers, thank you so much for subscribing. To those who did not yet subscribe, just click that red button right there now! So, yun nga no. Uh, we, will, we will talking about what? Things do you need to know about Brunei before you go here and travel and explore their country? So this is the information you need to know. Basically, it's for information only. It's not really. Uh, so we will talk about the things you need to know about Brunei before you travel here. Ayun, nakuha ko rin. Putang ina. Ang haba. Tagal kong pinirisisyo nun. Tae. So, number one, need to know, uh, Brunei is a Muslim country. And, oh, tama. Ito ay Muslim country, so, respect them. Okay. Number two is Brunei is ruled by only one person that is their sultan so it's not like philippines that every people have the right uh, actually here they have the right uh, actually uh, who uh, the one who will decide is the sultan so that's it oh tama kayo wala hindi po hindi po Sila democratic country na katulad sa Pina. Number three. Number three is when I have so many cars. Yes. Tama. Ang daming sasakyan. So, yun na nagiging problema kung minsan dito. Hindi naman siya. Hindi naman dun sa traffic siya. But, uh, Reality, oo, oh, tama. Marami sa lang sasakyan. Kasi, um, nakikita ko doon sa mga bahay-bahay nila. Sa bahay nila, kung hindi dalawa, o tatlo, o apat yung sasakyan na parahi sa garahe nila, mas marami pa doon. Yung mga iba pa nga, nandun na sa tabi, kinakalawang na, ganun. Basta maraming sasakyan, actually. Number four, Yes, Brunei ay mayaman sa gas. Oh, isa yun sa pinakakuan nila dito. Gas is one of their 
product here in Brunei, oil production is one of the product here in Brunei. Sila yung pinakamarami, actually. Number five is Brunei is zero crime rate. <laughs> yeah, you heard it right. It's zero crime rate. Tama po, zero crime rate po sila dito. Mm -hmm. Kahit iwan mo yung cellphone mo dyan, hindi yan mananakaw. Babalik pa sa'yo. Number six. Number six na tayo. So, uh, number six. Yun, zero tax rate. Oo, oh, tama. Zero tax rate sila. So, ibig sabihin lang nun, pag bibili ka dito, mura, 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 mura. So, uh, if you want to buy some stuff here, it's not so expensive because it's zero tax. Zero tax rate. Number seven. Number seven is the I always heard that Brunei is a boring country, but I doubt it because why do I keep uh, coming back here if this is a boring country? You know, di na ako babalik balik pa dito, bibisita dito kung ito nga ay boring country na enjoy ko nga dito kasi tahimik, mapayapa, walang lasig. It's just like I'm on my province, you know, so it's okay for me here. Isa sa Manila naman, grabe. Number eight. Number eight is Brunei is one of the richest country dahil ito sa kanila mga langis. Ama, isa sa pinakamayaman na bansa itong Brunei. Hindi, totoo yun. Pinakamayaman siya. Number nine is, is there's no liquor or alcoholic drinks even cigarettes there's no here. Wala kang makikita dito nagbebenta. You cannot see anyone on the shop selling liquor and cigarette so which is nice pero kung ang hanap mo mga ganon ay eh, wag ka dito wag ka na lang pumunta dito kung yung mga ganon ang hinahanap mo o yung mga nightclub yung mga sigarilyo yung mga alak mga babae wag ka na lang pumunta dito okay kasi wala kang makikita dito nun. pero pag ang hanap mo ay eh, katulad ko na explore isang country or mamasyal sa mga magaganda nila or nature spot nila eh, dito ka number 10 is all people are people here are friendly and disciplined kahit tumawid ka sa kalsada pare, hindi ka sasagasaan yan, titigil yan at titigil, hindi ka tulad sa atin sa Pinas, pag tumawid ka sa kalsada, kasalanan mo pa <coughs> Oh, ganun sila ka-disiplina dito. Yung pagbili ng alam ng pagkain. Sa atin kasi, pag bumili ka ng pagkain, para ka silang, bububugagad. Dito kasi bumili. Talagang pipila ka. Pipila sila. So, it's so nice to see uh, like that. Uh, hopefully, that Filipinos are like that also. Sometimes, sometimes others just want. So, even sa pag-process ng mga papel mo dito, inaabot ka lang ng one day to finish everything. Not like in other country that takes so long. So, ayun nga, no? yun yung mga sampung dapat yung malaman dito sa Brunei bago kayo pumunta dito. So, una, Muslim country. Pangalawa, ruled by Sultan. Pangat lo uh, basta yun yung mga yun yung mga yun kaya yun, yun so before you go here so may konti kayong idea kung ano ba yung lugar nila ayun nga thank you sa pagsubscribe uh, thank you sa panonood sa mga may mga nalaman kayo sa akin dito so kung bago ka lang uh, pakikot mo na lang yung subscribe button sa baba okay hanggang lang dun lang muna to Thank you.
Peace.